Okay, hello everyone. This is a quick session on how to um, download the iSAMS iParent app. So first thing you do is you go to your app store and search iSAMS or iParent um, and it should automatically come up at the top. So here we will download it. Just wait a few seconds. Okay, to download the parent app, the first thing you need to do is link it with the school. So our school code is ECOL, E-C-O-L. Okay, when you check school code, it will come up saying this is a valid school code. As soon as you press OK, it will automatically redirect you to the English College um, Islands. Now, your username and password um, should have been emailed to you. Okay, so here you'll use this username and password. Now, once you've done your username and password, it will save. You won't have to keep um, logging in and you can kind of link it with your fingerprint like I have done. Okay, now um, as I'm staff, I have to put in a verification code. You won't have to. So bear with me one moment while I do my verification code. 800235. Okay, so you don't you won't get this section with regards to the verification code. Once you've logged in, um, you are good to go. Now you you would get a notification saying allow notifications. I would always put allow. That way any news items or messages that come through will pop up on your phone. So this is your dashboard. Um, here will always show any news items, so very similar to D6, anything we post or any communication will appear here and when you kind of just click onto it, it will give the options to view it as a document. Okay, um, just takes a few seconds to download and then you'll be able to open up um, the document as normal, exactly the same as you would on D6. Now in addition to this, along the bottom, you can see my children, um, communications, information, notifications. So if you click on my children, so this is my boy, he's currently in FS. Um, when you click on um, your student, all the key information is here for you. So any school records would appear, um, any key school contacts. So if I click onto that, here I can see his form tutor's email, his head of house's email, 